Hello, my name is Sasa and well today I am here with another video. Okay, well again in this case we are going to animate now officer doggy. Well for this tutorial if you want to follow this tutorial you can use a free model. Okay, so I am using a free model that I just right here in the toolbox here. You go here, click toolbox and then you just press, uh, you just right here in models, doggy and well uh, there are many kind of doggies. And I found this one, Officer Doggy, that it looks pretty good. Okay, well, it doesn't have the taser or the teaser or whatever is the name. Okay, but you can uh, look for taser and then you are going to get it for this, okay? And then we just go to animation. Now with animation, if we select this one, we are going to move all the body because there is only one part, but that's okay. So here you have, and then we are going to move this arm forward a little bit. Well, actually Doggy is walking with two arms in front, like using the taser or walking with the taser. Or teaser, taser. I hope that is taser. Well, anyway, so we connect this, we connect this, and then we are going to move the taser a little bit because it needs to appear that it's just like pointing forward. We connect this, and then we are going to move the taser a little bit because it needs to appear that it's just like pointing forward here that's why i it's good to add a connection to the taser well that's okay so now uh, now let's work with the legs down uh, back i mean and this is going to be forward here now the head a little bit down and that's it we have the starting position we copy ctrl c then we go to the last frame ctrl v then we go to frame 15 and we just move the legs this and this then we just activate loop and then we just check i guess that's okay probably we can move a little bit the side for example here for this left and then here to the opposite side a little bit and then we just copy the first one ctrl c in the last one i guess that looks more natural i guess for for the moment it's okay so then you just save your animation you just select a uh, export you write like officer doggy walk and now we are just going to make like a animation for the jump scare so for the jump jump scare we are going to start with the position that we were walking okay so i guess that's okay we just move the arms i mean the legs and align the legs here you move, go to the to this part to see better. Probably we can just drag a little bit the torso because we move it. And that's it. You have your this one and well according to the video, well you need to start here and then it's uh, using the other one. Let me check the video. Well according to this, he starts like this uh, and then it starts fight uh, shooting with one hand okay so well this is the initial position uh, let's uh, destroy all of these frames that we have here sorry here okay we destroy all the frames that we have and then we are just going to start with well in the part the first part is like kind of uh, using this and then trying to point at you I guess that's okay 
let's use this one first to drop the hand to take the, 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 the thing we can press R to move it a little bit forward so this is the first position so, and then it's going to we remove the loop to and then in the last part it's using the taser to let me use here this one okay it has you and then it's going to shoot with one hand so we have the last position well the last position it's with one hand so we open a little bit the arm here and then we just move this one up then we just move the taser and then we just uh, move this arm actually we just reset the arm so we just select here and reset selected and probably we are going to open it to make it more dramatic and then yeah that's it that's the final position okay so let's watch this in slow mo so we just drag this okay needs here shoots so you need to shoot but we need to copy this to give some pause a little pause okay that's it so I'll go here and then shoots so let's see that when it shoots let me check probably the arm moves a little bit up for the impulse and then down and then returns to the original position well, like this I guess to the original position here okay and then he's going to return well, he's going to stay in this position ah what well, I, I, I destroyed something there Sorry, I made a mistake. So he's shooting. This is shooting. Control C. Control B. He's shooting. But also the hand is going to stay there. Mm. Take this I guess that's okay okay it's too much for here so let's move this arm a little bit Okay. I guess that looks okay. Shoots here. So it's going to shoot here. So we have a little pause. Now we are going to move for the time. Let's say here. Okay, now we are going to select these frames and we are going to move the easing style. So we're going to select cubic. Okay, and then we do the same for these ones. We select here, is in style cubic, and then we just select uh, out.
Ok. So he's here. Boom. Apunta. Mueve la cabeza un poquito hacia abajo. Se mueve la cabeza un poquito atrás. Y aquí a lo mejor se mueve un poquito para abajo. para acá and that's it I guess that's okay for this animation to work okay so he's going to start there let's say that the animation plays a little bit here so we're going to copy the first frame, just to have a little pause, control B, and then in the 6 we start. Okay. Okay, we check, boom, start this thing. Just disable here, snap to keys. Here I'm going to move a little bit the taser. Mm. Uh, now the hand a little bit. Okay, we move up, then down. Okay, we added like a movement here. Like shooting, okay? Well, that's it. And that's the way you animate a doggy animation like mini tune, okay? So, well, I hope that you like the video. Okay, so you want to test the animation, remember that you can do it in my uh, you can check uh, my other video my previous video with rush okay so you can check how to upload this animation to test it as a starter character and that's it my name is asa and i will see you next time bye bye